Yo, what's good guys, and in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to make low poly pine trees inside of uh, Blender. One thing before I get started on this video is, I want to just mention this Discord server that, that I'm in. It, you, could, you could talk to other people inside the server and also just get to know uh, some critters. And yeah, another thing that i like to also mention is uh, my Twitter, if you can, um, and you're able to for you guys to just follow my twitter and also if you can be sure to like and subscribe and also turn on the turn on the bell uh so you could so you guys can't miss uh more of my future videos and yeah let's get right into the video so first step is when you're in blender what you're gonna do is just select the cube with left click delete the cube press shift a and uh add cylinder so when you add the cylinder, uh, what you're gonna do is just bring down the vertices all the way to around like, uh, I'll say 12 or 11. I was gonna go with 11. And now what you're gonna do is just go into edit mode, select the whole top with alt and left, left click, scale it inside. You're gonna add a loop cut, and you're just gonna select this bottom part, scale it out, just like that. And now what you're gonna do is just actually delete the bottom face by uh, selecting this whole bottom part and pressing Dell and you click face faces now what you're gonna do is just select these edges uh, just do it like in a pattern so just like this this is good it doesn't have to be equal and you just bring it down just like that I'm just gonna make sure to just bring this down just a little bit. And now what we're gonna do is just select uh, these parts oh, here too. And you're just gonna select them in a circle. Just like that. And you're just gonna bring it down. And what I recommend is just scaling it out. This one I also recommend just scale, bringing it out just like manually, just for a nicer look. So it's like, it's not too perfect, you know, it just like has little uh, mistakes on it when it's something that has little mistakes on a model it just makes it uh, look much more impressive so something like this is good I'll just scale this uh, just a little bit more and yeah I think that's good so now what you're gonna do is just like the top part over here um, just like that and you're just gonna bring it down and I'm just gonna select the top face and just scale uh, down a bit, just like that. So now what you're gonna do is actually solidify it. So once you solidify it, you're just gonna bring it all the way up to something like this. I'm just gonna bring this down just a little bit. Actually, I'm gonna bring it up. And now what you're gonna do is, before you move on, I recommend it like you uh, press V to just like uh, just break apart the model. This will just add like cuts to the tree, just to make it nice. And you're just gonna do it for this one too. And I'll do it for over here. Don't make sure to not add too much of it, but something like this is good. And I'm just gonna bring this one up. So something like this. I'll also just make sure to scale this like down a bit more. And it's just out. Actually, yeah, that's good. So now what you're gonna do is just click apply. And you're just gonna scale these out just like that with S. And just bring it up. I'll I'm just gonna fix this little error right here. And yeah, I think that's I think that's it. And now what you're just gonna do is just duplicate, well, duplicate it, scale it in, uh, uh, scale on the z-axis, just scale down just a bit more, duplicate again, scale, scale on the z-axis, scale it in, just like that. Just keep doing that till you get the results that you're looking for, and something like this should be good. 
so I'm just say this is good and now you're just gonna you make sure you find the this thing in the center and what you're gonna do is press M which it will open merge and press add center so you're just gonna bring this up now and that should be your results for a uh, tree so now you're just gonna uh, tweak up some stuff just rotate it around So once you're done rotating around, uh, what I recommend is also just scaling down the bottom. Just bring the bottom a bit more out, just like that. So yeah, this is good. And you're going to uh, shade smooth it. I'm going to go over here and just do it like that. I think that's good. So for the uh, tree's bottom part, what I'm going to do is just add in a cylinder, bring it down, scale it in. Um, oh yeah, before we get on the, the tree's, uh, the tree's bottom part, what I, what I recommend doing is just rotating this just to make it have a curve, you know? So just like this, and I'll just bring it just like that. Hmm. So like this. So now what you're gonna do is just get the bottom part, edit mode, select this top, and you're just gonna extrude all the way to the top. Make sure to also scale it and just keep extruding. Make sure you stay inside of the pine tree and just keep scaling it and yeah something like this is good so I recommend you make the wood also just a little bit more bigger not too skinny when the wood is a bit skinny it doesn't have the best results so just like this and yeah so I'm just gonna you also want to just actually yeah you also just wanna um, select the bottom parts and scale it up just like that and I'm just gonna shade smooth it auto smooth and yeah that should be good I'm just gonna scale this out a little bit more Hold up. actually and just like this yeah that's good so I'm just gonna import it into Roblox studio and just show you what it looks like and yeah I'll be back so once you have it inside the studio, you should have it in your base plate and just make like a shower color, just like this. And uh just make the wood brown. And yeah, that should be it. That's your results for low poly pine tree inside of Blender. So another thing, like if you want to add snow, you just duplicate it and bring it to the top and just make it like this. Oh yeah, just be careful with this one. And I'll just bring it like just like right there. So yeah, that's how you make a low poly pine tree instead of a uh, blender. And yeah, let me know what you guys think of it in the comment comment section. And oh yeah, also make sure to check out the Discord server. And also make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, thank you.